if you think about what's actually happening in the world today, over the next 10 years, the uh, a large, large number of decisions in companies are going to be made by people that were born digital. Right? The level of comfort with a completely different set of sources of information is very different from what we would have seen 20 years ago or 10 years ago. Right? Uh, if you think about how one infers things, you know, where, where, where do you get your, where do you get your backbone from? Right? It is just different. I mean, we are. It's a, you know, the, the whole notion of. Uh, of a digital society, right? And a digital society as being comfortable with with digital relationships as a way of influencing decision making and so on. It's just it's just, just different. And now that's just thinking about the sort of internet of people and the internet of social, right? And now over the next decade, go add, depending on who you're gonna go believe, anyone between thirty and hundred billion connected devices telling you what's really going on, right? It's gonna take you away from speculating what's going on to knowing what's going on. Uh, think about uh, just a silly couple of silly examples. Think about the economic predictions. Uh, historically there's been a sort of you do statistical information, you try to, to understand things. I contend that in five years with every single piece of machinery or major machinery connected in the world and you know, Google-like Google, Google -like aggregation, if you want to know the state of the economy, you're going to find it every day at 8 o'clock in the morning, right? It's going to lead to different forms of decision making. And maybe my five years, you know, prediction is wrong, and it's five years is 10, and maybe it's 15. It's not 100. So it's, it's a really the, uh, we're going to be able to rely on a lot more information as we make decisions, point one. And number two is the world is going to take decisions based on a group of people that grew up very comfortable with sort of a digital digital society. You know, that, that group is actually has a very different set of biases, a different historic biases. Think about uh, reference points and think about who are our influencers and so on. I think it's just different. I think it just looks better.